here with Trey County Locksmith, and we're going to be checking out the uh, American Padlock versus the Stanley Padlock. Um, both of these locks have uh, some some pretty distinct advantages over your basic, um, you know, you know, junky type of you know simple master locks. Um, as far as I've heard, Master Lock does now own American Lock, um, but hopefully some of the original ideas uh, that separated American lock they will continue to use uh, in their in their building thus far um, this is the 60 millimeter uh, 24 7 Stanley padlock and it has a six pin key it uses an SC uh, SC1 or SC4 keyway um, and it has a anti-drill plate that spins um, like so uh, this unit is 100% rekeyable. This one also has some of the same features. It has the shrouded shackle right here, hardened shackle here, and it uses a six pin key as well. Uh, it does have an anti drill plate. However, I don't like this one as much as this one. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, as far as the anti drill features go, uh, give that to the, the Stanley because this one would prevent a large drill bit from just ripping out the entire cylinder. Um, this one here, it only tries to divert a drill bit off of there. Uh, and in a large drill bit, you could drill the entire thing out, uh, possibly. Um, I haven't actually tried it yet, but uh, that, that just seems like this is a little bit better system to me. Uh, but they do at least address the issue of lock drilling, and they do both have uh, a, a form of defense against that. Uh, as we dig it a little bit deeper, um, I've pulled this lock all the way apart. You can see that video uh, whenever you want to check it out. But I've pulled this all the way apart. There are security pins in here. Uh, each one of these, each chamber has a spool or a serrated top pin with serrated bottom pins, actually. And that makes this lock uh, very, very difficult to pick. Uh, it's got fairly tight tolerances. It's, um, it's a pretty decent lock. Uh, the only thing that I'm going to give Stanley the nod on is that it uses a full-sized key and a full-sized cylinder. This is the same type of cylinder that you would find in your deadbolt lock. Um, so it's a larger unit. It's more difficult to drill out because the pins are bigger. They're full-size, full-scale pins, and they're stainless steel pins in here. Uh, so not only does this have the anti-drill plate that, that breaks bits and, and spins, um, but it's also got the stainless steel pin. So if you possibly did hit that shear line just right without rotating this rotator plate, you're going to hit that first pin and then that's going to divert you off. There are, are also spool pins in here. Spool pins are not in every single chamber uh, as this one, but um, this one has that addressed as well pick proof um, right out of the box probably the American lock probably does get the advantage uh, for pick resistance and and bump resistance however in the long term um, this lock could have some security features added to it to where I would be able to make it more pick proof uh, we could add some nasty things to this and design and build this a little bit better right out of the package probably got a little bit of pick resistance here a little bit of drill resistance here uh, the shackles thicker on the Stanley so cut resistance goes to the Stanley. Uh, all around, both of them are, are decent units and uh, would protect your stuff fairly well. Um, but I would go uh, ahead and, and give the nod to the Stanley again. Uh, you're probably going to be right around in the same price point, around 35 bucks, 40 bucks, something like that for each one of these. Uh, but that's where I would put my money on this one. And I've also used it. I've had it in the dirt, snow, mud, rain. Uh, all the nastiness, and it still continues to function uh, very, very well. So for more information, check out the website in the description box below. Thanks. Thank you so much. This is Wayne with Tri-County Locksmith Service. For more information, go to www.tricountylocksmithservice.com. Thanks. Alrighty, guys, this is the end of the video when you watch YouTube here. A uh, couple ways you can really help me out. Uh, is to go ahead and make sure that you subscribe. Click on the subscribe button right there and then come down here and share this video with Facebook and Twitter 
and any of the other uh, social media facets that you are a part of. Uh, this helps other people find my videos. It helps my videos uh, gain uh, count and, and gain uh, the countability and views, and that in turn helps me provide more videos to you with good information about security and the latest in technology today. So Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus are about the biggest ones. Uh, those are the ones that help out the most. And um, just posting those on there lets your it spreads that information uh, to your friends, family, anybody else that would be interested in watching one of these videos. And it it helps me get the countage I need to be able to continue to make videos and provide the information to you. So this helps out a lot. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.